Today we are so excited to be doing the Freak Shake Challenge. This challenge we each chose an aeroplane shake mix and then we went to the supermarket with our mums to buy some crazy toppings. But neither of us know what each other bought. They're still hidden underneath here. When we have finished our Freak Shake creations, we'd love for you to comment down below who you think won this challenge. So without further ado, let's shake it up! Woo! <laughs> in our freak shakes are these new shake mixes from Aeroplane. They come in four yummy flavours. Choc Lamington, Peanut Butter Fudge, Choc Hazelnut and Salted Caramel. I chose the Choc Lamington flavoured shake mix. For those of you not from Australia, a Lamington is a square of sponge dipped in chocolate and desiccated coconut and it offers a strawberry jam in the middle. They're really yummy. <laughs> and I chose Salted Caramel which is like salted caramel. <laughs> okay, you ready to see what we got? Three, two, one. Ta-da! Oh, okay. 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 okay, so I've got some coconut flakes, which taste really good, some marshmallows, some mini pink pearls, some musk sticks, some cherry ripe, some flake, some fairy floss or cotton candy, some lamington, some Oreos and some cherry ripe. So what do you have? I have a, a, some salted caramel biscuits, some little chocolate pearl things, some caramel popcorn, some Maltesers, some crushed up crunchies, a some pretzels, sorry, a donut, and some Twix bars and twirls. This, are yours? All your stuff was really good. Was, <laughs> I'm just so excited to make these. Let's okay, just let's go. Let's get started. To begin, you need to take your jar and coat the rim with chocolate or something really sticky. We're using melted chocolate, but you could also use Nutella, peanut butter or a thick sauce. Make sure to coat the rim and top of your jar really well and then stick your toppings or sprinkles into it. Now start putting on your toppings. I'm using some caramel popcorn, I'm using um, cherry ripe and uh, marshmallows. We don't like to waste the leftover chocolate, so we like to make chocolate shards. Simply do this by spreading your chocolate onto some baking sheets and then putting some toppings on top. <laughs> Gotta work quickly or the chocolate will dry. This looks awesome. Mine kind of went a bit crazy. I don't even, you can't even <laughs> see if I have pretzels on. <laughs> on top and we kind of went a little bit crazy. You just want to set them out at room temperature to harden and then you can cut them. So to make your milkshake you will need milk, your flavoured shake mix and some ice cream. The more ice cream you add the thicker your milkshake will be so let's make this. Big squirt. Go for it. Go. This is gonna be loud. Uh. Wow! So now I'm going to assemble my milkshake. So make sure you take your flavoured shake mix or some topping and coat the inside so you get a punch of flavour. Shake. Ooh, it looks good. Let's see. Now time for the whipped cream. So now we're gonna put in our chocolate shard that we made before. We've just cut it and made a big thing of it. There we go. Oop, it's not staying. 
Oh, I got a new topic so you guys can see. I think like a few must sticks in this. Going back around here. some lavatons on the straw so that adds kind of like a cool effect. <laughs> How cool does this look? Cannot wait to eat this. Yummo. <laughs> so Chloe, do you want to come over here? Okay, I haven't looked yet. Oh. You ready to look? <gasps> Can I have that? Are you up for the challenge? Yeah, but go away. I think mine's gonna be better. <laughs> okay, so now it's my turn. I wasn't even expecting it to look this good. I thought it was gonna like kind of fail, but guys, even if you don't have any talent, you can make these. They're so easy. And Millie, you wanna come along and see mine? Yep. Come on, here I am. Hey, I'll make this so easily. Open it. Your eyes. Oh wow, yours is so extravagant. Ah, they look so good together. May I say, we did a pretty good job. Woo! Teamwork. I cannot wait to try this. Let's, Let's try. try. It take time so it doesn't fall apart. Mm. Oh, that is so good. Want to try each other's? Yeah. We're just the other side. Everything is so good. That is so good. These look and taste amazing and they were really pretty easy to make so I would definitely recommend making them. Because you can basically put anything on top and it will just look gorgeous. So don't forget to comment down below who you think one and which one you'd want to try. Thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to comment, like and subscribe and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye! These look so good.